In this video, I go over my favorite way of using the drummer tracks in Logic Pro X and how I use it to make some really cool sounds. Uh, yeah, so stay tuned. So let's go with electronic. And it does add a little pattern, like whatever. So, but then you have like all the different sounds that Logic suggested for this type of, uh, of drummer. It's like big room, like whatever. What I like doing is using this and using their patterns with my own sounds that I pick and see what crazy variations I can come up with because then you're able to like kind of like make it your own. So let me do this real quick. Clear all the samples, all the sounds. All right, so we're ready. Now we're gonna go to Splice and I am going to look for effect sounds, one shots, some robots and science fiction. All right, and see what, what it comes up with. So since I have 19 and 41 credits, I, it doesn't matter. I'm going to choose a bunch of them. And then we're going to put them in to this drumming rack and see what types of patterns we can come up with. And then we are going to be able to record them. So I think that, so it's uh, 16 sounds per page. And we are going to have in our own personalized drummer rack. Let's undo all the sounds because we don't really know what the sounds are. And let's check out this first filler. Yeah, so you can make your own fillers. Let's see. It's a really cool plugin to mangle sounds. So let's see how this goes. Yeah, so you can, as you can see, you can like change up the type of percussion and like whatnot. Like make some like interesting like drone sounds just by adding a couple of effects. Yeah, this sounds interesting. You can do like a kind of like a driving like techno track with, with some of these sounds. Yeah, so if you're Run out out of ideas and energy to really figure out new sounds for your tracks. This would be a good way to go, and this, this is something that I use a lot, especially for like breaks. Let's bring down the the hell a little bit. Check this out.
Yeah. Check this one out. Yeah, so this is one of my favorite features to play around with the drumming. Drumming tracks in Logic. Uh, obviously, you can uh, change things around. Because each of these drummers or like sounds, they have different fillers and like whatever. Check this out. Interesting patterns is by changing up the the different samples that you use in the drumming tracks. So yeah, let me know what you think of this way of using the drummer tracks. Um, if you're using them in a similar way or another way, I would love to hear about that. So yeah, there you go, guys.